Our Senior Vice President of Sales and Marketing for Crane Carrier Company. And on behalf of Crane Carrier and its dealers, I'm excited to welcome you to the official unveiling of Crane Carrier's latest product entry into the vocational truck market space. I also want to acknowledge the members of the media that are here with us this morning. Our President and CEO, Randy Rollins. Our supplier partners, the work truck industry, the work truck um, NTA staff that's with us, and especially the crane carrier team that's joining us via live stream at our new Philadelphia assembly point. Thank you for sharing this exciting day with us. Crane Carrier was founded in Tulsa, Oklahoma in 1946 as a rebuilder of war surplus equipment. Shortly thereafter, produced its first severe service truck chassis for the oil and gas industry. Crane Carrier then soon became an iconic brand with oil and gas, mining, ready mix concrete, and a refuse collection operation, known for its robust design, long useful life, and custom options. Purpose built, quality driven. Crane Carrier has continued that legacy of providing highly engineered severe service truck chassis, fully supported through our Crane Carrier dealer network. Comprised of 35 dealer organizations operating from 132 locations across the U.S. and into Canada, our dealers are trained and certified to provide vehicle service, aftermarket trucks, or aftermarket parts and Crane Carrier trucks. Today, Crane Carrier proudly manufactures all of our engineered chassis and signature chassis brands from our 50-acre campus in New Philadelphia, Ohio. Back in 1974, Crane Carrier released the first low-entry truck for the refuse collection industry, the Centurion. Some of you may have remembered that. It was unveiled at the International Waste Equipment and Technology Exposition in Houston, Texas, and according to a press release back then, and I quote, it stood alone as the first such vehicle to be custom designed for the waste disposal industry. Today, Crane Carrier will unveil the first narrow cab low entry, class seven and class eight truck chassis for the vocational space, which will once again stand alone in class seven and class eight work truck. The LNT design, an acronym for low narrow tilt, is driven by customer and industry demand for a safer work truck chassis in multi-stop, last mile, and metro area operations, where the operator climbs in and out of the cab hundreds of times a day. A robust design that takes advantage of previously only available in heavy class eight offerings. Concisely engineered in a smaller package, that conforms to the safe use requirements of congested alleys, tight metropolitan areas, and surroundings that drive the improved need for uh, improved maneuverability. In voice of the customer discussions, work truck users expressed to us that operator safety was paramount. Eliminating the dangers associated with climbing in and out of multi-step conventional chassis, which would in turn reduce slips, falls, and injuries a safer environment that reduces workman's compensation. A need for interior ruinous without that pesky doghouse protruding into the cab, and yes, seating for three large workers. And while you're at it, they said, maintain the significant crane carrier design advantages that equate to long useful life and low overall cost of ownership. Crane carrier listened to the voices of our customers and the industry and once again, Crane Carrier has delivered. There it is. The low narrow tilt with cab width of only 82 inches. That's 12 inches narrower than our Class 8 LE2 and from our information, the narrowest tilt cab available today. The LNT brings forward a true low entry truck chassis with an 18-inch step-in height on both sides. 
The cab is Crane Carrier's iconic design, engineered, fabricated, and built in the USA. It features a fabricated steel shell, which stands up to the bumps and bruises that come with tight operating environments. A flat floor with seating for three, all steel dash and door surfaces for durability, and door configurations in a traditional hinge design, as well as bifold and flip up fold back options. OEM left hand, right hand, and dual steering positions produced online with full instrumentation, full operator controls, and factory warranty. Crane Carrier's radiator behind cab design with EMP electric fans that provides a quiet cab environment absent of the heat protrusion commonly equated with COE and LCF configurations. Initial GVW ranges from 26,000 to 35,000 single axle and by the way, with tandem axle and a single axle city tractor on the horizon. Powered by Cummins B6.7 liter in both diesel and compressed natural gas, coupled with an Allison 3000 series transmission and Dana axle, this is a domestic truck with domestic components. Refuse collection beverage distribution with a factory drop frame option. Multi-stop and last mile distribution, sweeper, and any application that demands mobile workstations and multiple door and steering designs, the Crane Carrier LNT has arrived. Let me remind you that tomorrow from 9.30 to 10.45 in room 240, there's a Crane Carrier update session scheduled, which will dive deep into all the specifications, available options, and how the LNT can be configured to meet your specific needs. Please join us in room 240 tomorrow to learn more. I'm going to open it up now for questions. Anyone? All right. Thank you again for spending some time with us this morning. Our sales and engineering teams are here. They're standing ready to ask, answer any questions you've got. Plus, we'll take pre-orders today if you want to place your LNT and get it into your fleet. Um, on behalf of all of us at Crane Carrier, we wish you a successful day at the Work Truck Show 2020. This concludes this press conference. Thank you.